Hey, good morning. I just wanted to do a quick video, basically just, uh, you know, wondering what, what are you guys' opinion on this uh, Israel and Iran reactor deal? Uh, it's now just in the last hour. Uh, it goes online tomorrow morning or sometime tomorrow, whatever, on the 21st anyway. But Iran has just, they've just unveiled a new surface-to-surface -surface missile that's supposed to be you know, highly uh, technical. They say it basically can't be uh, shot down, um, according to China anyway. That's pretty interesting. I mean, China and Russia are right there, along with Iran. And, um, you know, after four years of this, you know, saber rattling, and even this week, you know, the last thing we heard out of Israel really was on Monday, and they said, well, the reactor absolutely will not come online. And it's been a media blackout ever since. But um, I, I don't see how, China, how uh, Israel just says, oh, well, okay, we're going to just let this slide. I mean, they become the punks of the Middle East. I mean, after all this saber rattling, and now they're going to back down. I don't see it happening. I think at last minute, they're going to have to do something to hit it. And now on F-Town, F Bala's site, he's got a bunch of... Uh, latest breaking articles about um, that they may even, Israel put out something where they may even, you know, nuke it. And, you know, I think, you know, I don't know how Israel says, well, yeah, okay, we'll just allow them to checkmate us and we'll do something later. I mean, this loses face for Israel big time in the Middle East. They back down from this. I mean, everybody comes after them at that point. Uh, I just don't see it. I see a lot of, so the thing is, I see a lot of people around YouTube, and I was in a blog talk last night, and I was saying, oh, no, see, they didn't do anything. I knew they would never do anything. I don't know how they get away with not doing anything. In Israel, if they do nothing, they're going to get attacked mercilessly, I think. Well, I know one thing's for sure, the damn pucker factor over in uh, Tel Aviv's got to be pretty damn high today. I don't know what they're doing, but... Um, you know, it's not good, uh, here, uh, you know, in our markets, I mean, back to our, you know, situation, um, this Hinden, I did a video on that Hindenburg Omen. Well, that's reconfirmed again yesterday. So that's firmly in place. Um, these markets are like, an, <coughs> like an elephant on, uh, toothpick legs. You know, something's going to crash here pretty soon. You know, things are bad. Um. You know, anyway, tell me about this, uh, what your thoughts are on this Israel thing. I think we see something today. I just don't know how they can uh, ignore it. I just don't see how they can say, well, okay, we're, we're just going to stand down and let them reactor come online. Anyway, tell me what you think. Talk to you later. Bye.